Kahapon nung uh, pinag-uusapan namin yung uh, paparating na laban ni Marlon Tapales at nitong uh, Hiroki Teshigawara, eh, parang yung mga kasama ko, parang medyo parang kinabahan sila ng konti. Eh. Bakit kaya? Pag-usapan natin ito at saka um, himayin natin ng konti kung sino ba yung mga kalaban niya at bakit parang uh, dihado yata tayo. Pag-usapan natin yan. Mag-intro lang ako at saka baka hindi ka pa nakasubscribe dyan, subscribe hit that notification para like kang updated sa mga videos natin at saka mga pararating, pararating tuloy, <laughs> mga rarating na boxing po, uh, na lalo na pag mga Pinoy. Salamat! Powercast Sports, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Okay, sige. Uh, one take to, one take. Um, anyway, uh, ito po no, sa bad left hook, uh, Hiroki Tashigawara versus Marlon Tapales. Final eliminator joins Donaire versus Gabalio. So very good news dahil po mapapasama po yung laban po ni Marlon Tapales. Uh, Doon po sa undercard po ng uh, event ni Donaire Gabalio. Eh, alam na natin, eh, doon uh, magandang laban. Ito sigurado ko. Maganda rin na laban. At um, this is the second chance of uh, uh, itong si Marlon Tapales. So let me just show you this, uh, the record of Marlon Tapales. And then pakita ko rin yung record po ni uh, ng kalab- makakalaban niya. No? So Marlon Tapales, 34 wins, 3 uh, losses. Ta- palaki natin para mas makita nyo. Yan, 34 wins, 3 losses. At... Uh, yung uh, huling laban niya dito sa Pilipinas, uh, nag-tune up siya dito kay Eden Sazona, but uh, yung huling eliminator niya, medyo hindi siya pinala doon, 11th round TKO. Okay? Yung kanyang talo po ay um, kay David Sanchez, matagal na yun, 114, and then the other one was when he was still 112. So, atong si Marlon Tapales, di kalidad po ito na boksingero, hindi ito basta-basta, and uh, he has been a, a world champion. Pero yung mga kalaban niya, eh bakit naman na uh, medyo kinabahan daw at sabi nung iba, medyo dihado daw tayo dito. Um, let's see. No? Tingnan natin dito kung ano ba yung record ng kalaban niya at uh, kayo na po bahalang umusga. Pero I will also say my piece because I, I do know na medyo mahirap din talaga itong laban na ito. Hindi to basta-basta. Um, but I still believe Marlon the Palace ka, can win this one. 22 wins, dalawang... Uh, Tabla, dalawang talo, at ay, ayan po, 5-7 from Japan. Hapon po yung mga kalaban niya. At uh, actually, uh, may mga ilang Pilipino rin po na na-disgrasya nitong hapon. Ayan po, nakita natin si Glel Sumingit, uh, J- Jason Canoy, Jetro Pabustan, at uh, and so on and so forth. At isa pa pare, nakita ko mga picture niya. No? Itong hapon, nasa ala, uh, uh, si na Gio Santissima, nasa Omega, Kasparin si na Jack Tipora. So, he is well-versed or he he knows how Filipino boxers fight. So, then yes, it's true. It's it's not gonna be an easy fight. No, but uh, it's not gonna be an easy fight for both boxers. Kasi Marlon Tapales is also, uh, kumbaga, uh, one of our bright spots. Ang dami kong kakilala na uh, high regards ang tingin nila kay Marlon Tapales. And uh, me too, uh, high regard talaga. I think there was just some issue uh, in his last fight in New York, no? Uh, but uh, this time around, ako, um, I feel Marlon Tapales is gonna take this one now. This is his ch- second chance. Nandun na siya na sa California. The fight is gonna be in California. So hopefully there's no issue with regards to the, the weather and other outside of boxing. Uh, and especially stamina. If Marlon Tapales here showed up with his stamina and whatnot, I I will not be surprised kung uh, mapabaksak niya yung kalaban or manalo siya. Um I think Marlon Tapales ang nakikita ko mga mga training session and uh you know uh, we'll have an interview with him soon. Uh, I know that he is really motivated and inspired for this one. Just like yung mga Pilipino na nanonood ngayon, I want you to continue to inspire Filipino boxers at suportahan po natin you know, Marlon Tapales. If he wins this one, this is an eliminator, he will get another chance uh, for a world title. And it's gonna be big. Sinasabi ko po sa lahat po ng nanonood sa atin, followers, no? With the absence of Manny Pacquiao, we need not just one, not just two, but multiple world champion. And Marlon Tapales is right there again. Uh, pag naipanalo na to, punta siya sa gate ng, ano, ng world champion. And, uh, di ba? Um, so it's gonna be a big 
big fight, Marlon Tapales, December 11, December 12 dito sa Pilipinas. Let's support him. Um, I hope he wins by knockout. I hope he wins by knockout. Um, it's just that uh, if I'm gonna wish, di ba, mag-wish na rin ako, knockout na, para sure ball, kaysa naman umabot pa ng decision. So, let me know what you think. What's what's your comment? Dihado ba? Yamado pa? Uh, regardless of what you say, no? Um, uh, kung kayo ay tingin nyo, aha, yamado, tingin nyo dihado, basta, suporta lang po tayo at uh, panoodin natin yung laban. Yun ang pinakamalaga. Para mag-enjoy tayo lahat. Salamat po. Pausalud pa ako, sports. Thank you ulit sa pakikinig sa akin. Powercast Sports. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell.